Right, so when you buy your drop down rudder aftermarket one, probably the, like it, it's good, but it's aluminium and it gets a bit sticky in there. There's a few little mods you gotta do. In there, when it comes, it'll have an O-ring in there. Now, I'm wanting that, just stick that in there, lock it up, spin it around, and that'll undo. That's on a thread. Get your plumber's tape, whack around it maybe, yeah, eight, ten times around the thread. Then do that up tight and exactly square to the way the rudder's facing. And then, that won't move then. It'll be nice and tight with the O-ring, it can come undone. So get rid of the O-ring, put thread tape on there. The second little mod, because it's aluminium, it bends, it gets sticky, and I find found it getting stuck all the time. So it comes with a little pin that goes through that hole there and you screw it in there when you want to use it get rid of that drill out that so it takes a little bit bigger screw a nut and put a nut in the middle or a spacer nut works perfectly and that's so that's a bigger nut than what will spread and um, put on there. I've just used it a nut as a spacer and then do that up so you can see that's a lot wider. So that now drops down easily and you undo that one, pull that all the way out. And I use either like a square or a fitted chisel up in between the gap there and pry it apart. It's only aluminium, so it bends easy. Then that way it'll drop up and it'll drop up and down. That will. So it'll also just stop up at that point there. So it'll be hanging down a little bit, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, it still works great. And then that way it's always loose. Like it's just a couple simple mods to do to it, just to improve it, but it now works a treat.